Senior British royals have stepped out in public amid ongoing controversy over that digitally altered photo released by Kensington Palace. A Mother's Day portrait of the Princess of Wales and her three children caused a media frenzy after photo agencies issued a kill notice questioning its authenticity. The ABC's Europe correspondent Isabella Higgins has more. The royals were probably hoping for a day of friendly celebration when they stepped out here at Westminster to mark Commonwealth Day, but instead it was overshadowed by intense public debate around an edited image of Princess Catherine and her three children. Now, this is usually one of the key events on the monarchy's calendar, an annual service that celebrates the Association of Commonwealth Countries. It usually includes a message from the monarch themselves. Of course, this year that had to be delivered via video because King Charles is still still on a leave of absence from public duties while he undergoes cancer treatment. But here today, all eyes were on Prince William. This was his first appearance since that media frenzy broke around that photograph. Now, on his way here, there was a paparazzi shot taken of him and his wife, Princess Catherine, travelling. Now, this photograph was released by Kensington Palace over the weekend to mark British Mother's Day. They claim it was taken by the prince about a week ago at his home in Windsor. But just hours after it was released, the photo agencies who usually distribute these to media outlets issued a kill notice saying that there were inconsistencies with the image. Now, this has prompted Princess Catherine to take the rare step of making a public statement where she apologised and said she was the one who edited it, that as an amateur photographer, she often experiments with editing. Now, it might be surprising or seem somewhat trivial that this is dominating such public debate, but increasingly, the palace has been under pressure to provide more updates about her health as rumours become rife on the internet and in some parts of the press. And this latest photo scandal has only added fuel to the fire. So this event here today at Westminster is really showing the pressure that the royal family is under with just two senior members able to attend public events and now this public relations crisis. Howdy y'all. Welcome to today's read. Now the royal family's got a lot going on and I know there's other people that's read on this and I said I wasn't going to do it but the comments, good God y'all. I just, there's just some things I need to know because I kind of feel like this is, this is like Diana 2.0, you know, like Wills and Kate is, is well, they're the, the Prince and Princess of Wales, so I guess it goes along with the title, right? Well, I got a few questions I wanted to ask myself. Now, I've not watched any other reads on them. I've watched one uh, a thing on it from Minutes of Horror. That's how I found out about it this chick missing so and what I know I know from the comments so a few little questions here let's start off at the beginning let's see what is the truth surrounding Princess Kate having an abdominal surgery the truth surrounding the picture that's allegedly of Kate and her mother Now, y'all, why did they put that picture out on Mother's Day? That it was so obvious it was photoshopped, and it was badly photoshopped, and you know they knew that. So, what's the significance in that? I mean, what's the circumstances behind that? Uh, the kids' fingers all being crossed, like, you know, you put your fingers, cross your fingers from behind your back when you're telling a lie. It's circumstances surrounding Princess Kate's disappearance. Reasons. Who or what is responsible for Kate's disappearance? Reasons. Show us something hidden. And how did all wheels get that black eye? There you go. All right. Back to the first question. The truth surrounding the abdominal surgery. 
No, this is the hangman. The hangman understands that his position is a sacrifice. Ooh, if that's not a little bit uh, right off the bat there. It's repentance for past wrongdoings. Um, this up-down state symbolizing those who walk a spiritual path. Um, they see the world differently. They, they, um, they see the, the need for sacrifice. It's a particular need to suspend certain action. And the hangman is also a card of waiting in suspension. It's waiting for proper opportunities, taking action. Um, well, taking action not always been the best solution. Sometimes refraining from doing so being more beneficial. So was this a ruse? All right. Uh, is the abdominal surgery story made up? Oh, no. Did she truly have surgery? Yes. Mm. Is Princess Kate sick? Yes. Is she in a coma like rumors are saying? Yes. Uh, is this fatal? Ooh, yes. Alright. The next question is true surrounding the picture of allegedly Kate and her mom. This is the King of Cups. This shows the ability to restrain one's emotions. It's being fully in charge of your feelings and impulses. I feel like this is definitely Kate's mom. It's also aspected as an older male who's political and diplomatic, who balances the needs of others, and he's a leader. So that's going to be Prince Charles. So Prince Charles and her mom um, conspired together to put this picture out. The Mother's Day picture. Here we have got the chariot reverse. This indicates lack of control and direction in your own life and being at the mercy of opposing forces. So she didn't have no choice. They just put this they put this picture out. Nothing she can say or do about that. That's, that's done now. Why the finger kids' fingers was crossed. Uh, I got the Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups is a female figure is known for honesty and fairness. So, we all know, you know, cross your fingers from behind your back when you was a kid, you'd be telling a fib. So, is the kids signaling that this picture is a lie? Yes. Whoop. Okay. Circumstances surrounding Kate's disappearance. Or a sword. Now this is a, showing a moment of rest. It's retreat and withdrawal from chaos, anger, and pain that you've been currently in. Um... This is showing you're still tender from your battle wounds. It's a grim reminder of what was lost. And it's time to gather new strength and to prepare to face a new challenge. I'm going to finish reading the rest of them before I start putting this together. Because if this is going away, I think it's going. Uh, reasons. The two of cups reversed. I mean, we all know this is a, uh, a lack of harmony within a uh, romantic relationship. Is falling victim to some type of abuse in this relationship. A lack of equality, a breaking down of a partnership or a relationship, marriage, lack of mutual respect, and arguments. Who or what is responsible for Kate's disappearance? Here we've got the sun. Sun's a card of truth. It's um, the sun shining its light on deceit and lies, so it's revealing the truth. So it's not just simply. Her being sick, you know, somebody's responsible for this. Now, I'm thinking it's Mr. Wheels here. Uh, reasons? We got the Wheel of Fortune reversed. This is a negative and unwelcome change in your circumstances that's not only difficult to adjust to, but it poses a challenging time ahead. Is the current situation a result of the decisions you've made? Oof. Something hidden. Here we got the Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is a representation of. New beginnings. It's a sense of urgency, like a new lease on life. It's also the card that represents fertility, conceptions, and birth. Now, how Will got his black eye. We've got the Ace of Cups. That represents a new beginning in terms of love and happiness. Here's what I think happened. All these rumors about this um, this other woman that uh, Prince William was supposed to be been involved with. What was her name? Um... Rose, I bet you that Rose is Prince William's Camilla. This is that's what I said, Diana 2.0. But here, no, Miss Kate's done it differently. 
she's thought that if she got pregnant again and had another baby, that that would bring him back home. Because I think he stays gone with this chick. And she's confronted William and told him she was pregnant. Because, see, there was rumors about her being pregnant a little while back. And then it just stopped all of a sudden. And he's not been happy. They've gotten into a bad fight or put hands on each other. Some type of abuse. It's, I'd say this is the reason for the surgery and why she's in a coma. The wills hurt Kate. You know what? Did the royal that killed himself did he witness what happened between Will and Kate? Yes. Is this why he had to go? Yes. Ooh. Is Will and Rose like Ella and Charles? Yes. Was Kate pregnant? Yes. Woo, boys and girls. This is... This is Diana 2.0. I feel like she's still alive, but, I mean, she's she's in bad shape. She's definitely in a coma. This, my reading on Princess Kate of Wales. Her disappearance. And looking into the conspiracy theories that followed it. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.